how you doing? I want to show you something that I found online. I did not try it, so. So this is the LG G6 and it's for Sprint. If you go to settings, you can see actually the, the name, you know, the status, the software info, really important. So this is the software version LS993ZVA. So I wanted to unlock it for any GSM provider. And you know, Sprint is a CDMA provider. So right now it's locked to Sprint. I want to unlock the phone. So how can we unlock the phone? Go to, let's say Google. And from here, you're gonna search for LS993ZVA. And the first result is actually the page that we need to look. And this is the forum XDA developers.com. And here they're gonna give you instructions how to do it. So the first thing you need to do is you need to download these four files, okay? I mean, there's a tutorial here that we're gonna read later. But the first thing you need to do is you need to download all the files. And actually here, here are all the links so you can download all the files. And I have them right here on my download folder. So here are the four files, guys. The LG Mobile Driver, LG UP, LG UP, and there's a, what is the instruction saying? They say we need to install the LG driver. So it looks like this is the, the drivers. So double click on this one. And we're going to say yes. Okay, LG mobile driver. So it says English, United States. And it's installing the drivers for the LG. Next, LG Mobile. Okay, LG Mobile driver installation successful. Okay, and then what did, what did they say? Install the LG UP. This is the LG UP, all right, so install this one. Could not verify, I'm just gonna say run it. Okay, accept. And it's installing the LG UP. Install Shell Wizard. Oh, okay. What is this? Do you want to allow this app from a, a non publisher to make changes to the devices? Yes. Do you want to allow this app from an unknown publisher to make changes to the device? Yes. I said yes. Okay, so now it's working and it is completed. So we're going to finish this and now it says unzip the patch. So this is the patch. We're going to unzip it. So how can we unzip it? I'm going to extract the files here and I should get a folder and it's right here, guys model and I have an executable here too. Inside the patch you will find a folder called model and the file LGUP executable which we must paste in the path where the LGU program is installed and thus replace the ones that already exist there. Generally the path is here. All right guys so we're gonna look for this path okay so this is usually it says program files so we're going to the C drive and we're gonna go program files 86. And we're gonna look for LG Electronics and look for LG UP. LG UP. All right. Recommendation delete the folder and the existing file first and then paste the new ones. So I said delete the folder and the existing file first. We need to delete the model and this one. We're gonna delete it delete from the original source which is program files all right so once we delete it we're gonna go back to the download folder and we're gonna grab the model folder and the lgup file so we're gonna copy this now we're gonna go back to the program files folder 86 lg electronics and we're gonna look for this folder lgup and here 
you see that we don't see the folder and the file because we delete it, but we're going to paste the new ones we downloaded. You'll need to provide administration permissions to copy to this folder. And I'm going to click continue. All right, so I pasted these student files. Now it makes sense. All right. Put our LGG6 in download mode. Turn it off. Okay, so now we're going to work with the hardware, guys. This is the phone. We're going to turn it off. Power off. Sprint, okay. Put your LG G6 in download mode. Turn it off. Press volume button plus. Turn the device completely off, no cables, and then click on the volume up key and then plug the phone. The volume up and I'm gonna connect it here. So let's see what happens. And it says firm update. Do not unplug the SUV connection until the process is complete. So what let's check, let's let's go back to the tutorial. So it says open LG UPX executable. So we're gonna open this. Run. Okay, and then let's see what else. Now with the LUP open in the file path section, choose the downloaded. So here guys, you need to click here and you're gonna choose one of the files that we downloaded. So we're gonna click on these three dots and this should be here on the downloads, right? And actually it's this one guys. So select it and then open. Mark the option partition DL and click star. So partition DL, where is partition DL? Oh, here, guys, select this one, partition the L, and then we're going to start. Okay, so it's starting, guys. It said process. Okay, so this is the other one, partition list, called partition list, in which we will mark the box select all. So select all, and we'll click give it okay. Boom, okay. So this is what happening on the device. COM3, do not unplug the device, finger upgrade. Okay, and then they're gonna ask, partition change, do you want to continue? Click yes. So we can see here the progress, guys, is 11%. And you can see here the progress also. Firmware upgrade. Do not unplug. Okay, guys, so we are at 77%, 78, so it's going fast. Uh, it's almost done. And it says here on the instructions, that the phone is gonna, okay, it's restarting. But we're gonna wait for the finish though. We need to see something says fit, completed, I'm sorry. So once we see completed, it says here, disconnect your LG G6 and it's ready. Android will start for the first time. And you have to configure it as a new device. 99%, so let's see what happened guys, 100%. Okay, so this is the message that we are we need to see click here to continue and it says complete make sure you see this guys disconnect our LG and it's ready click here to continue click here to continue complete disconnect your LG G6 and it's ready okay so we're gonna disconnect it guys and he it says it's ready he said, here's an important point. In my case, when I finished flashing my LG G6, it was in a boot loop and it was constantly restarting without stopping. So to fix that, it's necessary to perform a factory reset. I mean, volume down and power. So once we see the logo flashing, we release the power for a second, then we go back to the power button and keep it. There you go, finally guys, we need to see this, all right. So, volume key, power key, uh, delete all user data, including LG, carry ops, and reset all setting. I wanna say yes. Oh, okay, so with the power key down, you're gonna select yes. Oh, power key on the bottom, so that's okay, boom. 
All right. Finally, guys, so he's erasing all the data. So he's, he's doing a hard reset. So that's the hardest part of the tutorial. Let's see if it works. Yeah, guys, so he's finally, he's finally doing it. That hard reset, you need to do it in order to work. So Android is starting. Do not turn the phone off. And the next step is gonna be inputting a SIM card to see if it works. Oh, look at that, how beautiful it is. All right, so let's do it. The US, let's see the US, guys. The US, next. In SIM card, SIM card, I'm gonna skip this. Set internet connection, I'm gonna, let's, now I'm gonna see next. No internet. Don't skip. All right, so let's connect to the internet, guys. Hold on one second. Let's connect to the internet to see what's going on. It's connected. Next. Set up as new. Checking network. I hope Spring doesn't block it or lock it. Software update. Checking for updates. Checking info. Okay, I'm gonna skip the Google thing. Skip. I'm gonna disable all the tracking thing from Google. I don't need a name. I don't gonna set up the fingerprint. Skip anyway. I'm just gonna do the first one. And this is the phone, guys. All right, so now we're gonna check with a sim card guys ready for the last step i already put the nano sim card from metro and i'm about to make the famous 611 phone call and let's see what happened this is metro pcs and i see your phone isn't active on our network that's it guys so now let's check this out really quick Network Metro PCS LTE in service. And what it says here Metro PCS. So that's it, guys. That concludes the tutorial on how to unlock the LG G6 from Sprint to any carrier. Thank you so much and i want to actually thank these guys these guys are awesome xda developers and the one that put this uh tutorial is and this guy is ferga 2790 all right unlock lg g6 with all the steps awesome thank you so much guys um how do you like this tutorial guys do you want me to do more tutorials like this um do you have an lg g6 do you like lg phones let me know in your comments uh please interact with my videos guys support my channel if you want more videos like this and don't forget to subscribe i'll see you in the next one peace thank you